Hello, Digimon fans! Well, 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 December seems like a pretty exciting month. Yeah, ah, uh, well, you know, we talked about the Dukemon DC1 Grand Prix previously. Yep, and I'm sure plenty of you are out there playing Evil Cups week in and week out, trying your best to win the Omega Mon Champion promo. Yep. Well, actually, this month brings us something pretty cool, and it wasn't supposed to be uh, launched this month, actually. Yep, it is none other than the delayed SD14 Bilzebubmon Advance Deck. Yes, that is right. Yeah, it got uh, delayed uh, for two months, but it is finally here. Yes, well, uh, this uh, Advance Deck is actually the first advanced deck in this game yep i mean uh, bandai keeps improving their decks uh, starter decks yeah i started with the basic ones with the six colors remember those with uh, little small packages yeah uh, <laughs> i don't have an example today because i'm not at home yeah well i'm on a vacation helping my aunt house sit at home <laughs> yeah so uh yeah they started off with the small uh, starter decks yeah those were really compact really cute and then they upgraded it a little with the uh, Dukemon All Force version, yep, yeah, the Dukemon All Force ones were slightly bigger, and now they went one step further to make an even cooler starter deck. Yeah, and they call it an advanced deck. So what's an advanced deck? Apparently, it's much stronger than previous starter decks. Yeah, I know the Dukemon and All Force one, or you know, uh, the Another World Tactician, and uh, was that the Imperial Dramon one? Yeah. All of them were much stronger than the first six starters, yes, but apparently this is even stronger. Yeah, it can even go head to head against Metadex. Well, I mean, that's according to Bandai, so uh, will it compare against a Black War Greymon X or uh, maybe a Cross Hunter? Well, who knows? I haven't tried it yet. <laughs> yes, so apparently it's uh, built to face meta decks yes so uh you uh, everything in the deck box you know once you, you can just buy the advanced deck go to a tournament open it up and play it's got everything you need apparently play mats some um, uh, sleeves yeah but they don't have those uh pretty cool you know they don't have memory counters and those pretty cool labels you know the security attack plus one yeah all those are in the english version <laughs> i wish I, I wish we had those for japanese as well i mean those were pretty cool well maybe they'd be introduced in you know future starter decks or something yeah maybe some products so what's what's cool about this uh, advanced deck is that not only it can play uh, against other meta decks yeah apparently it's that strong they also come with some reprints yes these reprints were uh, pretty popular cards like uh, x antibody and um okay there was some confusion previously on you know how many reprinted cards are there and uh how many you know will you get so apparently some people thought that you know there are 10 kinds and you only get nine but um uh seems like uh, it's officially confirmed that you get 10 promo cards i mean 10 cards outside of your advanced deck cards and there are only nine reprints yes so does that mean that you get one copy of uh, i mean one extra copy of one of the nine since there are 10 cards well maybe and some people speculate that you get nine pieces and one extra copy but if you're lucky you might actually get a parallel art Bilzebubmon. yes yes there are people who actually speculate that this Bilzebubmon is part of the 10 uh, promo cards which is why uh, they put 10 instead of just 9 yeah but some people speculate that you know it could just replace the normal art sr so which is it i'm not really sure actually yeah so uh, we must hope that you know i'm lucky enough to hit one of them yeah <laughs> well speaking about the high rarity builds of Bumon, wow i can't believe that uh, Bandai pulled a gacha on us, especially on uh, starter decks, but <laughs> I mean, I mean, this is cool. It makes uh, things exciting. So actually, you know, uh, basically, uh, I would usually just get uh, two copies of each starter, but not this time. This time, <laughs> I got myself a box of starters. Yes, literally a box of starters. <laughs> 
Well, it's uh, not that many uh, cards in, uh, I mean, not that many starters in here. Yeah, I mean, in that one's deck, um, there are only six. Yeah, yeah, six of them. I would actually have uh, bought uh, a carton if I knew that, you know, they had something like uh, this parallel art visible mon, which uh, apparently, I'm not sure, I'm not sure, rumor says that you can only get uh, one out of uh, 48 starter decks i don't know well six let's hope I've, <laughs> i'm lucky enough to get in, get one of them in here yeah come on let's unbox it and see whether i'll get any parallel art visible one or if i'm lucky enough to get more than one <laughs> Okay, here we are. Yep, this is the advanced deck builds a Pumon. Yes, a box of uh, starter decks. <laughs> How often do you buy a box of starter decks? Well, uh, maybe it's gonna be the norms moving forward. <laughs> and okay, here it is. We have six uh, advanced decks in uh, one box. Yep. That is right. So uh, first things first, we'll take out the first uh, advanced deck and just take a look at what's inside. Yeah, I mean, uh, we also want to see what's the difference between this and uh, other decks, right? Yeah, so uh, let's just uh, look at the contents a bit. Yep, it's written here at the back. Yeah, so uh, this is uh, the contents of the deck is, um, okay, 54 cards. Yes, this is your deck. Okay, it's always 50 cards and 4 digital masks and uh, sleeves, 60. Oh wow! Okay, they gave uh, 60 sleeves this time instead of uh, 50 like the DC1 Grand Prix set. So if you accidentally busted a sleeve or something, you still have spare. <laughs> okay, and uh, it says uh, memory gauge 2, 2 pieces of memory gauges. Yep, and over here what's this? Uh, play map? Yes. One playmat, yep, uh, just like, you know, the previous decks, which come in such a big box. And um, index, index cards, okay, three index cards. Yes, they've been having this since uh, ST1, you know, how to play the game and whatnot. Yeah, uh, apparently the filler cards in uh, every booster pack are called index cards as well. Yeah, so I guess the boosters also have them. <laughs> and uh, the last one says uh, special... Reprint cards, nine types, total of 10 cards. Okay, wow, okay. So we know that, uh, you know, just like what I said previously, they have nine different type of reprint cards and uh, they have 10 cards in them. So one of them is probably gonna come, you know, with an extra copy, yep. Yes, so uh, now let's look at this uh, starter deck. Look, it's uh, more or less the size of uh, the Duke Mon and uh, all four starter decks or the Imperial Drama. Yeah, I mean the, the last few starter decks Yeah, I don't have one to compare, but yeah, the size is definitely similar. I can't believe that they've got, you know, extra stuff inside. Yeah, so uh, yeah, it's kind of pretty cool. So uh, let's uh, see what's in it. Oh, okay. I forgot to cut it open. <laughs> All right, let's see. Uh, cut it open over here. Yes. Okay, oops, 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 yes, got it open. Okay, all right, it's open as well. And let's check it out, what's in here? Ooh, okay, Ooh, wow, wow. So, you know, quite, looks quite compact. You know, cards are pretty close to the top, unlike the previous starters where they actually had them standing up somewhere in the middle of the box. Yeah, let's pull it all out. And woo, wow, oh, okay. So that's how they fit the sleeves, you know? Um, yeah, that's all. Nothing else in here. And this is how they fit the sleeves, yeah. Even though the size is the same as previous, the previous starters, but they wasted less space right now. Yeah, so uh, let's open up the bag first. Okay, ooh, let's see. Oh, okay. Uh, let's check these cards out later. Um, oh, we can check them now. Yeah. So, this is the packet of sleeves. Ooh, they're nicely packed. 
See, there's a Bills of Boomon logo over here. Looks pretty cool. Yes, and over here, what are these? Okay, this, oh, starting in front is the deck. And behind it is the reprint cards. Yeah, I mean, usually they put the promos in front, but it looks like they put it at the back this time. So let's see what uh, reprint cards they are. So this is uh, SD7 Guilmon. Yep, SD7 Guilmon here. And uh, oh, SD8 Vmon. Okay, that's pretty cool. Uh, I thought they give the BT3, but it's the SD8 one. Yeah, you know, the, the art seems pretty cool. Yeah, they're beautiful. I love them. And oh, okay, Algamon. Okay, it's a Digitama, yeah. This is the BT2 Algamon. I never thought I'd see it again, but yeah, I guess it, you know, it's pretty cool, yeah. And uh, oh, this is an option. Yes, uh, Retreat Tactics, yep. And uh, over here is Sonarizamon. Oh, oh, wow. It's the promo Sonarizamon. Yes, the one which uh, gives you piercing. Yes. Oh, wow, wow. This is pretty cool. This is pretty cool, you know, uh, because a lot of people have been looking for it. And uh, well, looks like they reprinted it. Yeah, just like what I said, you know, it's a smart move to bring, you know, uh, bring back promos in uh, such products. So yes, this is a great move, Bandai. Well done. And okay, we have Bagumon, SD6 Bagumon. Oh, wow, wow. EX2, oh, okay, okay. Oh, I got two EX2 Imon, okay. And uh, oh, wow, okay. That's beautiful, EX2 Imon. Okay, two copies of this. So uh, will I have two copies of uh, EX2 Imon or, um, well, you know, will I get uh, two copies of others? Well, who knows? Yeah, let's see. Um, well, there's a BT12 uh, Bills of Boom on as well. And uh, X Antibody! Wow, okay. Yes, uh, this card uh, is pretty useful. You know, it's a staple in all uh, X Antibody decks. I even have one in my Ragnar Lord deck. Yes, so uh, as we can see, I didn't get any uh, Bills of Boom on in uh, i mean the parallel art builds of Bowman in my reprint cards yep so is it in the main deck ah oh, i'm talking as if you know i'm expecting myself to get one yeah so let's see let's see okay great okay yaman okay all right these are the digitamas and uh, impmon oh wow impmon is an sr Ooh, look at the shine i love it yeah Okay, and this is a uh, Candlemon. Okay, ooh, this is, okay. Oh, oh, wow, okay. Even commons and uncommons are foiled. That's pretty cool. Yeah, you can you can see the shine, yeah. Although the shine of the uh, Impmon is uh, nicer. You look at the rainbow shine, but look, all of them are foiled. Wow, that's pretty cool. Yeah, initially I thought, you know, only Rare cards had, uh, you know, foiling, but this whole advanced deck is foil. I mean, that's pretty cool, yeah. And oh, here it is, Bills of Boomon SD14. Look at the shine, and it's also textured. Yeah, I mean, uh, we've also had that for the Duke Mon and all four starters. And oh, Bill Starmon, another. Wow. Okay. Wait a minute. That's a lot of SRs. Two. Four, six, oh, wow, eight, eight, wait a minute, six, two, four, six, eight, yeah, wow, eight pieces of X SRs over here, yeah, that's pretty cool, yeah, and they've even got I and Makoto over here, yeah, and some options, oh, wow, wait, <laughs> BT2 Impmon, yes, it makes a comeback. Oh, okay, so they've also added some pretty old cards. And wow, promo Wizardmon, okay. That's cool, yeah. It's good that they added promos in here as well. Okay, and a BT8. 
Uh, oh, okay. EX2. Okay, and these are the memory gauges. Yep. Okay, and the index cards. All right. Wow. Okay. So yes, yes. This deck is pretty cool. Yeah. I mean, they've got a uh, foil cards. They've got eight SRs. Wow. But it's just two copy of each. Yeah. So essentially, you still need to get uh, two uh, starters before you can have a playset of them. Okay. So let's put them back in. Okay. Um, well, no hits in the first box. Okay, let's look at what's under this. Okay, oh, the Playman! Woohoo! And okay, so one side is Impmon and the other side is Belzebubmon. Okay, that's pretty cool. I think that's just like the memory gauge, right? Yeah, how was the memory gauge? Yeah, yep. Impmon and Beelzebubmon. Yeah. So, okay. Looks pretty cool. Yeah, I mean, you can just like uh, take them up, leave them up, and then uh, bring them to a tourney. Yeah. You can even use uh, some extra cards from here. Yeah, you've got uh, Impmon, which can help you boost your deck, or Beelzebubmon, BT2. Yeah. Oh, 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 it's the secret rare. Bills of Bumon. Okay, I just noticed. Okay, that's cool. A secret rare reprint. Wow. All right. Okay. So, uh, yeah, pretty cool here. Now, now we've done with uh, checking out this box. Uh, I mean, checking out this advanced deck. Let's go to the fun part. Unboxing five other starters. Yes, but it's gonna be pretty fast because I doubt that, you know, uh, we would be uh, looking through it like just now. Okay, let's see. Mm. All right. Second starter. Oh, this, you know, the cards are kind of impatient. They actually came out <laughs> themselves. Okay, let's see if uh, it's within these cards. All oh, right, uh, previously I talked about, you know, having two Immon. Will I have two Immon as well? Or will I have maybe another Gwilmon or something? Yeah, let's just check it out. Okay, one, two, three. Okay, same, only one piece, one piece and, oh, two Immon, okay, oh. So it looks like it's constant, yeah. Or, you know, I might get uh, either unlucky or lucky. I don't know how to describe the, you know, the situation. Well, that maybe uh, is, I'll get another copy of something else later, yeah. So, okay. Is it in here? Is it in here? Oh, no. There's a boomer. Okay. No, it's not in here as well. Okay. Let's uh, go for the next box. Wow. Okay. Yeah. Over here. Open this up. Okay. Third box in. Honestly, I don't know. What's the rate for it? Will it be uh, one every carton? Oh, beats me, we'll see. Okay. All right. Let's start with this first. Okay, let's see. One, two, three, four, Five and oh, is it? Oh, yes, it really is two copies of uh, Impman. Okay, yeah, so yeah, probably you know, you won't be getting two copies of X antibody. Well, I really hope I did, I would, but looks like it's unlikely now. 
Let's see. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Will I get the parallel arc Beelzebub on? No. No. Both normal arts as well. Okay, let's see. I want to add some suspense to it. Okay, it's right below Baumon, and there are four Baumons. Okay, all right. We'll see, we'll see. Come on, come on. Uh, who knows? I haven't, uh, you know. Uh, I haven't found the Bilzerbaum boom on yet, so who knows? It might also come with the four, I mean the ten uh, reprints, yeah, because there are only nine types, maybe one, you know, one of the Ipmon, I mean the advanced deck with only one Ipmon would have uh, one parallel art Bilzamon, yeah, I mean if it comes in the starter deck, it might seem, you know, pretty, uh, you might get the shorter end of the stick because you only have one normal art uh, Bilzamon, so yeah, who knows? It might come in this. So let's see. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, here it is. Oh, oh, another Impman. Yep, nothing else. Okay, let's see. Okay, one, two, three, four. Impman. Oh. This is getting pretty slow. I'm sure my video would take half an hour if I went on like that. Let's see, Balmon, where's Balmon? Okay, here it is. One piece of Balmon, two pieces of Balmon, three pieces of Balmon, four and, ooh, two in our mod, because of mod. Seriously, I don't think this is working. Yeah, I don't think it's working. <laughs> Two more boxes left. Two more boxes left. Okay, I'm hoping I hit it. Okay, well, let's see, let's see. Well, at least, you know, this is not as messy as, uh, you know, boosters. Yeah, I kind of don't really have much luck with uh, all these uh, high rarity cards, like uh, the gold cards and uh, Ghost Omni, yeah, Ghost Alpha, yeah, I never hit any of those before. Although, yes, as if you all have been watching my unboxing videos, you would have noticed I hit quite a lot of uh, Parallel Art SECs at the start of, uh, you know, the game, but I guess my luck started to run out. One, two, three, four, five, six, ah, oh, it's in one. Oh, it's another M1. Okay, nothing. Let's check this out. Gosh, now I legit wish that Soon was here unboxing with me because we could go at it at a faster rate. <laughs> okay, let's see. Yamon, Impmon, Candlemon. Okay, come on, 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 rest Balmon. Which one? Okay, okay, we're here, we're here. Baumon. Okay. Did you see anything under it just now? No. So one, two, three. Oh. Oh! Oh! It's a normal art. Okay, so I don't think there's any cards in here. Yeah. Okay, none. Okay. So. <gasps> <sighs> last box uh, somehow I'm feeling I don't know am I feeling positive I gotta feel positive come on I gotta hit it with the last advanced deck yes it's empty no I should have gotten more I should have gotten more yes Okay, well, let's see what's in here. Come on. Pray hard. Let's hope. Oh, wow. Let me just look at how these stuff are packed. Or was I too rough just now when I was commuting? I don't know. I mean, look, all of these are you know, 
sliding out of the holder. Okay, let's see. Points out. Okay. Okay, I've got a good feeling that I would get the parallel art builds them on in here. Let's hope I don't eat my words. Oh, Impman and oh, it's yes, still Impman. Okay, no parallel art builds a boomer. Okay, come on, come on. Ooh, okay, let's see. Okay, let's just take the top half off here. Okay, which mon? Which mon? Baumon. Baumon. Third Baumon. Fourth Baumon. Okay. Okay. Well, I have a Bilzamon here. Okay, let's see. Fourth Baumon. So uh, let's just leave three cards. Okay, let's just assume that this is the fourth Baumon. These two are the Bills of Bumon. Okay. All right. Well, I get a Bills of Bumon. The parallel art. Oh, it's just the normal art. Oh, no. I didn't get any parallel art. Yep. Is it over here? Come on, please. Nope. <laughs> Nothing. Okay. Wow. Okay. Six decks and nothing. I guess <sighs> I might have to buy some more. <laughs> Six advanced decks and no hits. Uh, am I going to regret that? No, I think it was worth it. <laughs> I mean, yeah, uh, according to Bandai, this is a really, really, really high rarity uh, card. Yeah, so who knows? Would it be, you know, one per ca uh, carton? I'm not quite sure myself yet, but I definitely didn't hit it in a box of starters. <laughs> well, anyway, regardless, it's still a good deck. Yes, Bandai says it can actually go head to head against uh meta decks these days so uh, i mean what's so cool about that well that's what we're gonna talk about here we are gonna talk about how to play this deck yes indeed well basically this deck focuses on milling so you gotta build your trash as fast as you can yes so uh, you start by playing i and makoto yes uh not the EX I Makoto, but the ST14 I and Makoto, yes. So basically, it's a searcher and it can also gain you memory when you digivolve. Well, most importantly, since it's a tamer, the memory gain cannot be stopped by memory blockers. So yeah, you don't have to worry about memory blockers. Well, after you set up I and Makoto, these are the three cards which you would need. Yes, uh, we've got a Candlemon, and a Baumon, and Witchmon. So basically, Candlemon's on play effect allows you to trash two cards from the top of your deck, while Witchmon and Baumon both have when digivolving effects that trashes three cards from the top of your deck. So you keep bringing these three Digimon out and keep trashing the cards from the top of your deck, and when you hit 20 cards in your trash, it's time for business. Yes. You gotta bring out this little fella here, yeah! So, Impmon has this when attacking effect which allows it to digivolve directly into Bilzebumon for only 3 cards. Seems familiar eh? Well, it's a uh, deja vu that we're having another warp shink of Bilzebumon. <laughs> well, although this time the effect is from Impmon, not the Bilzebumon itself. Well, that's pretty good because this Bills Boomon gains you 1 memory and 1 extra security effect for every 10 cards in your trash. So even if it's a 3 cost Digivolution, you'd essentially get 2 costs back since Impmon's effect only works if you have 20 cards in your trash. Add on the 4 cards that you trash when you Digivolve into Bills of Boomon, there's also a chance that it would be a free Evo. I mean, if you have uh, 26 cards over there and yeah, you hit 30. And let's also not forget, you've got I and Makoto, so yeah, free memory there. So, um, uh, what are you gonna do with all that memory again? Well, 
Digivolve into Blast Mode, of course. Since Blast Mode can unsuspend itself, it's a good idea to hit your opponent with Bilza Boomon first, then Digivolve into Blast Mode. You don't really have to worry about its Digivolution cost as well, because if you Digivolve directly from Impmon into Bilza Boomon, you'd have 20 cards in your trash, which means you can gain 3 memory from the Digivolving effect of Blast Mode. That's pretty cool, huh? Well, to make things even sweeter, we've got the Waifu card. Bill Starma. You can play a straight from your hand, and her play cost is reduced by 4 for every 10 cards in your trash. So if you have 30 cards in your trash, you basically played her for just 1 cost. Pretty useful for late game comebacks. You can even flood the board with Rush Immons to complete the comeback. So, what do you think about this advanced deck? Pretty cool, huh? Yeah. I kind of like, you know, how, you know, the, the deck engine of this uh, advanced deck works. It's pretty cool. It mails and there's quite a lot of synergy with all the cards in there. Doesn't seem like there's any useless cards in here. Yeah. And overall, it's a pretty cool advanced deck. And will it match up against uh, meta decks these days? Well, I mean, who knows? Uh, you can try it out as well. I will definitely try it out, but... Um, I couldn't try out in time because, I mean, this is a launch day unboxing video, so yeah, I didn't actually have much time to play it, so uh, who knows, yeah, I might just try it out, and uh, maybe in the next modern high, yeah, so uh, what do you think about this deck, how many boxes or how many cartons are you gonna buy to hit that elusive uh, parallel art Bilzamon? yeah, <laughs> hit me up in the comments, let me know if you hit it, or you know, how many cartons you already pre-ordered or have picked up from your local store. Yes. Well, that's all from me today. Thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. See ya.